I'm looking for Riza Tor. That's right. Very good. Just to remind you how to use Riza Floor, uh, take care to create new floor slab, your height 10 feet, for example, okay, cancel this one, view, uh, drawing grid, I don't care about these grid lines, insert, point, your first point zero, zero, second point uh, 10, zero, 25, 0, 35, 0, 50, 0. You remember these coordinates? Uh, 0, uh, I think 15. <coughs> 15, yes. Uh, 10, 15, 25, 15, 35, 15, 50, 15. Uh, 0, 25, 10, 25, 25, 25, 35, 25, 50, 25. Uh, 0, I think uh, 45, 10, 45, 25, 45, 45, 45, 50, 45. View, show a uh, point label, here is your point that represents the location of your columns. Any questions so far? Pay attention to me. Pay attention, please. Uh, insert, you can draw your column first, your beam first, as you like. So let's try with beams. Beams, uh, explicit shape, your cross section, your depth, uh, I think 30 feet, uh, 30 inch, uh, 16 inch. Okay, apply from this point, to this point, if you have beam, go ahead and draw your beams. If you don't have beams, that's all. You have flat slab, go ahead and draw your columns. Uh, insert columns, explicit. Your cross section, I think, 20 inch time 20 inch. Okay. Apply. Uh, you can one click and stretch your click to draw your column in one second. Not click, click, click. No, you can one click at the beginning, then keep uh, pushing your click and stretch your click. Your mouse. You can. <coughs> Sorry. Draw them in one uh, type. Anyway, insert uh, slabs, slabs, your thickness, four feet, uh, four inch or five inch, whatever. Draw, apply, click at each corner of your slab. Please go back to the first corner. I am done. If you would like to, to check your shape, uh, this icon, here is your slab, your beam, and this one is opening because it's uh, stairs, and your column. Uh, insert, loads, area load. Your area is, uh, your load, <coughs> light load, storage, public, surface, area, so office. And uh, just click. 
apply click in each area you are feeling you have life load you, I would like to check load combination so I will find the program will do your uh, combination required combination did load did load plus life load did load time 1.4 did load time 1.2 uh, life load time 1.6 <coughs> Go ahead and solve. All of, all of this stuff is good. We, go, we are good right now. Uh, if you would like to show up the label of each column from this icon, do you remember it? This one. What what we did with this uh, item? Do you remember? We check the for slab, for slab, contour fell, contour. Do you remember which one? MX and MC. Elmer. Yeah. Do you remember which one? MZ or MX? <coughs> and we are choosing here strength dead plus life, and we can put your maximum and the minimum value for your steel reinforcement. Do you remember how to design slab with this one? If you are trying to show up the label of each column, you have here beam, column, wall. Four show columns, go ahead and select label. Okay, here is the label. But I don't like to show up uh, this one. Here is the label of each column. So if you would like to show up the label of each column from this icon, beam, column, wall, show columns, select here label. Okay, you can show up the label. Why? Because results, column forces, I can show you, let's start, results, I'm sorry, results, Column results will be better. Concrete, what do you have here? PN, total reaction on your column. So I have question. This reaction equal 35.659 kip. At which column? Column called CS2. Which column? Where is CS2? Here you go, C, S, 2, this code. So I can, I can show up what is the reaction in KEP 34 at column C, S, 4. Where is this column? C, S, 4, this one. Okay, okay. I would like to design my column. If you have full version uh, or if you have license for this one, I can mark any column and say, right click, copy. If you try it, copy, we'll say, no, coming is not available because you have demo version. But if you have full uh, license, you can make copy. If you cannot, okay, go ahead <coughs> and open your <coughs> Excel. Write the name of your column with your hand. Write what is the reaction from your software with your hand. This is the only option right now. I cannot make copy. Okay, but if you have full version, if you have license, you can make copy. You can select like this. Select your column, right click, copy, come to Excel, right click, paste. You can get your column, okay? So I will copy or I will write only two columns. This column, what is showing up the name of each column, and this column, what's showing up the reaction on each column? Any questions so far? Any questions so far? So right now, I got two columns from my floor, which represent the name of each column. From this figure, I can know what, where is my column? So if you have column CS8, where is this column? Here you go. Uh, if you have name CS18, 
There you go. So, with this print and with this sheet, I can know what is the name, where is the column, what is the reaction on each column. Any questions so far? Yeah. Uh, the PN doesn't matter on MX or MZ? Like no, B no. is a normal, not, yeah. a, not X or Z, it's a vertical reaction. Okay? This is a vertical reaction, normal force. Any question so far? Any question? You will use this technique in designing of truss member. If you would like to design 100 member in one second, pay attention to me. Okay? So I can put the name of each member. I can put the internal forces for truss member. If you would like to design your column in one second, I will put the name of each column, the reaction on each column. Just a second. Anybody remember how to design tight, short column? Yeah, P ultimate equal, I think, phi 0.8, yeah. 0.85, FC prime, <coughs> area gross, minus area steel, plus F yield, area steel. Do you remember this equation? Perfect. Okay, uh, for my for my project, uh, based on the contractor, Fc prime equal four thousand. F yield sixty thousand psi psi. I'm going to assume. Actually, you have range from one percent to eight percent. So I will assume area still equal two percent of area gross. Do you agree? Go ahead and put your numbers. Point phi, uh, I think, phi equal 0.65 for tight uh, column. FC prime, 4,000. Uh, area gross, I don't know. Area steel, 0.02, area gross. F yield, 60,000. Area steel, 0.02, area gross. Any questions so far? Any question so far? I think you should did all of this calculation during your exam, I believe. So I put my numbers. I found this part only unknown, one unknown, area gross. So your P ultimate equal this number, 2,356 point Six four area gross. If you are using your calculator and calculate these numbers uh, based on area gross, the only unknown, you will find your equation becomes like this. If I'm looking for area gross, what is the value of area gross? Equal P ultimate divide two thousand three hundred fifty six point sixty four. Do you have any question? Uh, just a question. Uh, do you know what is the meaning of P ultimate? Yeah, I know. Meaning of P ultimate is the total <coughs> reaction <coughs> on all. Do you agree? Yes. Inbound. Because all of my units bound and the inch. So do you think P ultimate, which is the total reaction on your call, do you think this reaction is this one? No. No? No. No? no? This reaction for only one floor. This reaction is coming from your reason. That's right. Go back to your reason. Ask yourself. Ask yourself. This one. This law. <laughs> which give you your reaction. This model for one floor or for your 10 floors. One floor, your reaction only for one floor. So that means this reaction only for one floor. So I'm looking for first what? P ultimate. What is the value of P ultimate equal what? You know? What's this value? Equal 
this number time 10. I assumed my number of floors equal 10. Do you agree? Just enter, come back, double click at this point. I got P ultimate for all the corners. Third or fourth column, what is the area gross for your column? Your area gross equal total reaction in bound. Remember, this reaction right now in Kemp. Because your unit on Riza floor was in Kemp. So your area gross area gross will be equal. Equal what? Number. This number time 1,000 to convert it to pound. Divide by this number, 2,356.64. I got area growth for all columns in one second. Do you agree? Do you agree? OK. Your column with area gross equal this number will be rectangular column. So I have the uh, length B, I have another length C. So I will assume B equal 10 inch. So go ahead and assume your distance B equal, don't write equal, just write 10. So I assumed B equal 10 inch. So what is the value of C? C equal area gross divide what? B. That's right. So your C equal this number which represent area gross divide this number which represent B. I got C for each code. But your C should be integer number 